Hello queens and welcome back for another wash day review. Today we are going to be reviewing a new collection. It is Texture ID and we're going to be starting out using their Curl, Curl Clarifying Shampoo which contains honey. This product is sulfate free and it is a clarifying cleanser. And let's get into this hair type chart. I am all here for it. Comment down below if you're here for the hair type chart you guys. So I did go in with a hot oil treatment. I let it sit in overnight. And again, we're gonna start out with the clarifying shampoo. I love the consistency of this product. It's very creamy. It smells good. So you guys know I had to check that out. And of course, once you apply it to the hair, it instant, instantly begins to lather. So what I can say is that it does provide minimal slippage which i will show you guys in a second i love the fact that it does cleanse the hair thoroughly without stripping your hair as well um again if you're looking for more slip i will highly suggest going in with a pre-poo as you guys can see here where i'm trying to detangle at the roots now also to just make sure that you detangle very well before you even start your wash day that will help as well So if you look here, you can see that my hair is of a more 3C or a 3 than an A, but I do have some 4A in the back, but you can see I'm able to glide my fingers through a lot easier in this back section. So let's do a quick hair length check. And as you guys can see, your girl is past bra strap length. It's just out of the frame. So exciting. So again, we're gonna go in with the clarifying shampoo. And as you can see, with my hair just being freshly rinsed, that it is a lot more kinkier in the front. As you can see, it's a little bit more shrinkage at the roots as well. And so I'm gonna simply focus the shampoo towards the scalp, which is more important, honestly, than your ends, because once you rinse your hair, it will be cleansed as well from the shampoo being rinsed out. So I can say again that if you would like more slip, again, go in with the pre-poo, but this is a really good shampoo. I really do like it. And again, I just work the shampoo down the length of my hair. So this is my hair freshly rinsed and we're gonna check my hair tight. So as you can see, it's a little bit kinky. It does have a little bit of wave to it. So we are going to refer to the hair type chart. So looking at the hair type chart here, you guys, on the packaging, you can see that I am a type three with four. And closer towards the front of my head, I am more of a type four, as you guys can see here, with some wave as well. So now we're gonna move on to the three times moisture cream conditioner. This one as well contains honey. It smooths the hair and it helps to retain moisture, you guys. And I have to say, I am loving this hair chart on the packaging. So I must say that this is a thick, product i love that about conditioners honestly because it just makes sure that your hair is fully coated and saturated so as you can see i just simply applied the conditioner on my hair i would suggest to make sure that your hair is fully saturated when using this conditioner because it will really help with actually absorbing the product as well as being able to detangle your hair in the shower so i am going in with a little bit more because my hair is a little bit thicker at the roots and again it's a little bit more kinkier so i need something to help with actually you know detangling my hair and then ensuring too that every strand is covered so i love using the clarifying shampoo in conjunction in conjunction with the three times the moisture conditioner awesome combo you guys uh, my hair loved it feels phenomenal and i am currently presently on day i should say five or eight hair eight day hair i can't remember but let's get back into the review all right queen so here it is i'm just gonna give you guys a quick rundown of texture id this is my first time using texture id so i'm pretty excited because i do really do like how my hair felt after using the clarifying shampoo and the three times moisture conditioner so like i just stated the shampoo is a curl clarifying shampoo i do apologize if you guys cannot see that because of my lighting but this is a curl clarifying shampoo and again what i love about texture id is that it's for all hair types and i like too that they put down here the different hair types because you guys know pretty much when you're going natural a lot of times you don't know your curl pattern so for them to actually put a mini chart on here for those who are newly natural or have been natural but don't know their hair texture this is a great chart to actually refer to when washing your hair after using the shampoo because the best way to figure out your hair textures after you have freshly cleansed and washed your natural hair with no product on it whatsoever so I already knew my hair type but I just wanted to validate and just make sure that I was correct and my hair is a type 3 4 
where it is kind of springy and then it can get a lot more kinkier so I have these two textures I don't have two but I really do have three and four mixed together and I have a lot more of the four towards the front of my head versus in the back so I really did like this shampoo you guys it's sulfate free and it gives a clarifying cleanser next I went in with the three times moisture cream conditioner now when I use this product you guys I did not realize that this was a two-in-one so you can use this for a co-wash and a leave-in so I love that when I was in the shower I was reading the back of it and so this product here is the ultimate versatility found in one conditioner this rich and creamy formula hydrates thirsty curls while providing superior slip for ultimate detangling and improved manageability and like I said it can be used for a co-wash or a leave-in so for me I got this so I can use it in conjunction with the actual clarifying shampoo and I try like a new brand I always try to get the shampoo and the conditioner together if I don't get anything else because I want to ensure that my hair is getting the full experience with using a new collection so I really do like that another thing that I like about this three-time moisture cream um conditioner <laughs> is that it really does hydrate the hair now initially when you're putting it on your hair it may not feel like you're getting like a lot of moisture and a lot of slip but believe me put a good amount on there not a whole lot but a good amount to make sure that your strands are evenly coated and then let it sit on your hair while you're in the shower for about five minutes or so and then rinse it out before you get out of the shower and I'm telling you my hair was buttery soft like super duper soft it had a lot of shine it had a mad slip and my cuticles were literally smoothed down and that's what this product helps to do so it says here it smooths hair and it retains moisture and again this one contains honey as well and I I am just shocked I really do like the shampoo and the conditioner together i'm so happy that i did purchase this at salads i did get this at salads where you um buy one get one half off i think it's the sale that they're having right now but definitely when they have a buy two get one free sale i'm definitely going to purchase some more products from um texture id so i really did. so we're going to be using the texture id deep treatment mask i'm sorry deep treatment mask so this is what we're going to be using today and it states here that it contains sweet almond oil, wheat protein, and honey. It restores strength and hydration. So with this container wheat protein, I'm not sure if you can use this um, every single week, but we're going to find out in a little bit. So it says here that it helps to repair dry, frizzy curls with this formula designed to improve porosity and manageability. Okay. Oh, I haven't heard of a product actually helping with um, improving your porosity of your hair. So I'm going to have to do a little bit more research on my own after this. And it states here, honey and sweet almond oil help, help retain the moisture that curly hair needs to flourish. Hydrolyzed wheat protein replenishes hair's elasticity to reduce breakage. Okay. The results are hydrated, soft, and defined curls. And the direction says here to apply a liberal amount to wet hair, paying extra attention to your ends, which you should always do when you're deep conditioner. Always make sure you pay attention to your ends because those are the oldest parts of your hair is the ends and it states here to leave it in for seven to ten minutes it can be used with a hooded dryer or steamer with the pla plastic cap optional rinse well so being that it does state here to leave it on for seven to ten minutes i'm going to leave mine on for 20 minutes because i want to make sure that my hair gets an intensive deep conditioning treatment today especially since i'm getting ready to go to new orleans on friday and i want my hair to remain moisturized and prayerfully i do not have to redo my hair this weekend because depending on the humidity I may have no choice but to redo my hair but hopefully texture ID can help with that so let's get right into trying this baby out and again this is the deep treatment mask from texture ID and again they have the indicator chart here as to what your hair type is I love right. it so we're going to start on this back section here and I'm going to take I'm going to start out with this amount for the back section because I don't want to put a whole lot on here and look at the shine on my hair. So that's why I said I really did enjoy using the shampoo and the conditioner because I could tell that my hair was moisturized. Like, look at that. Look at that, y'all. Shine, baby. Okay, so now we're going to put the actual deep treatment mask on. And what I like about the actual trio... Well, I actually got the um, foaming mousse as well, which I will be using shortly. But what I do like about the actual shampoo, the conditioner, and the deep treatment mask is that they all smell the same across the board, which I know I'm a big stickler about. And 
my hair is really just sopping all of this up and if you guys are not aware honey is must be apparently like a trend right now because a lot of these brands are starting to incorporate honey into their products even though some of the ones that I have been using for a while have already been on that but honey is so good it really does help with um, being able to retain the moisture in your hair and you know putting it back as well so that's all I'm gonna put on this section because this is all I need and I need to trim my ends just a little bit but I'm probably gonna do that after well actually before August but I really do like this deep conditioner y'all it is cray cray like look at that my hair is such nice shine it has such nice slip as y'all can see, y'all can see it coming through on the camera. Like, this isn't because of my lights. Like, this is just my hair with the product on it. And I can even feel the difference of my hair after using the shampoo and the three times moisture cream conditioner. So, this is my hair with the deep conditioner on it. Soft, moisturized, and shiny as hell. I love it. I love it. Okay, you guys, so I decided to go in with Flexi Rods for this particular wash day simply because I did decide to pick up the mousse for this um, review. So I'm using the Thermal Multi Styling Foam from Texture ID. This product does contain wheat protein as well as argon oil. So that is why I decided to again go in with the Flexi Rods. You can honestly use this for a twist out as well, and I can say that because I used it over the weekend while I was at Essence Fest, and it is a multi purpose styling product, and I love that. So, of course, we're going to start out by making sure that we moisturize our scalp, and I just went in with some castor oil, of course, from Jamaican Mango and Lime. So I'm going to be using these flexi rods from the main choice. I use the small ones and the larger ones and I do like that I did do this step. So taking one pump of the actual thermal multi styling foam, I would highly suggest that's all that you really need honestly. A little bit more than you're super good to go because I'm telling you this product has a lot of slip to it and it's weird because as soon as it applies onto the hair it's almost like it kind of liquefies it even more so um i just wanted to um put that in the video and i'm just using my texture pro detangler brush this is a new one i got this at burlington you guys and i actually picked up two of them for pretty much two for one and i just love this tool it's very good with detangling the hair and especially smoothing your strands together and just showing your definition as well so as you guys can see here i like the way the mousse enhanced my curls and I just love it. And it just has such nice slip. The formulation of the product is very nice and soft. It's not drying whatsoever to the hair. And I'm simply gonna be doing the horseshoe method for styling. I did um, refer to this styling method from Curl Days. So that's where I got this um, styling method or technique from you guys. And I really do like to use it because it really does help with me being able to get all of my hair onto the actual flexi rod and not having to use a whole lot of them. So with this multi-styling foam, you guys, it helps to strengthen and protect the hair from breakage and it improves shine and elasticity. And it's a heat protectant as well of up to 450 degrees. So for those of you who like to blow out your hair and dry and um, I'm sorry, style on stretched hair, this product would definitely, definitely work for you. So you guys, I'm just gonna continue simply repeating the exact same steps 
And I must say, I am very, very, very pleased with the, with the results after using this mousse, or this foam, I should say. It's perfect for achieving the ultimate body and bounce with a light hold. And it does exactly that, you guys. It's a lightweight alcohol foam that helps shape and define curls while adding a boost of smoothing shine. Cool. <laughs> So this is my hair, you guys, pretty much after setting and styling. And so we're going to get ready to take them down because I did leave these in for two days intentionally because I just wanted to make sure that my curls were, you know, super enhanced. And so I'm just going to simply take the um, flexi rods out here and begin to separate. Make sure that you apply some oil to your fingertips so that we can minimize as much frizz as possible. And I have to say my hair is super soft. It was shiny. It does have a lot of bounce as you can see here. Um, the takedown was super easy as well. Um, my hair, um, I had really did a amazing job at actually applying a decent amount of the thermal multi styling foam and you want to make sure that you do that so that way your hair can evenly distribute you know your definition once you go for the takedown because you don't want it to have some definition in one part of the section and then the other half it doesn't so as you guys can see here you just want to be careful in separating as well and you want to roll your finger around the curl in the direction that you actually rotted it onto your flexi rod so be mindful of that because you do not want to disturb the curl pattern we did all this work and you don't want to lose your definition so here's a close-up of the ends of my hair and i'm telling you i loved my results i really did So you guys, this is pretty much it for the video. Again, I got these products from Sally's Beauty and I'm just so happy after using Texture ID, you guys. So thank you guys so much for hanging out with me and I will see you guys in my next video, queens. Bye.